This video is about installing the simulator for simulator and unlocking it and a comparison to some other simulators. First download the setup file from here. Unzip and run the executable. OK, let's run this process which takes less than a minute. Now when the simulator is first run, it will run for half an hour or until restarted before an unlock is needed. Let's restart the simulator. After this, an unlock is needed. This allows the user to register for email updates or they can click the No Emails box. Then simply copy the unlock key here from the web browser back to the simulator and click Unlock. The simulator will now run for 30 days or 99 sketches and will load any sketch of up to 150 lines. At the end of this time, we recommend upgrading to the Pro version if the simulator is still useful. Each Pro license comes with upgrades until the end of the year and then an annual subscription can be taken up for under $10 currently. OK, some other Arduino debugging tools. First there is Visual Micro. This tool allows for breakpoints and debugging and it works by adding more code to your sketch and takes over the serial port. This is recommended if you like using Microsoft tools having your code run slower and don't use a serial port. While it is advertised as free, sometimes, the real cost is US $85 to US $2,500. Another tool is Autodesk Circuits 123. This seems to work well but runs slow and the colours are not very visible. Here is a sketch which turns on an LED. The yellow transmit light should be flashing every second. Virtual Breadboard is another simulator which costs $39 and may be infringing the Arduino trademark logo. The last is Code Blocks for Arduino. This is free and works well, but there are no output simulation states. Finally, here are some stats from the Vertronics website and the top five lead-in sites which all have reviews of the Arduino simulator.